Hello, uh, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 43 of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play, the most in depth playthrough of this game on YouTube. In the last episode, we took on the trial, we took on Acerola's trial down at the abandoned Thrifty Mart or whatever it was, and managed to win uh, for our sixth trial. If you want to check that out, make sure to click the i-card up at the top of the screen. Now in today's episode, we're going to start by going through this desert right here, um, seeing if we can make it through, collecting whatever items we can, etc, etc. Jet is already hurt, that's cool. Um, and then we'll continue on from there. So if you're excited for today's episode, make sure to like button down below, do subscribe if you're new. Both of those things help us out in becoming the next big thing. Let's go ahead and start with a quick team recap. First up, we have Frisco, our mascot, the level 34 Oracorio with Air Cutter, Peck Pound, and Teeter Dance, holding the sharp beak. Then we have Arukenimon, our pet, the level 33 Araquanid with Leech Life, Bubble Beam, Infestation, and Bite, holding the Watery MZ. Then we have Negative Vibes, our level 33 Pokeball Eating Snorlax with Body Slam, Brick Break, Defense, Crow, and Amnesia, holding the leftovers. Then we have Jet, our favorite, the level 34 Umbreon with Payback, Bite, Quick Attack, and Sand Attack. Next up we have Brock, the... I don't know. The level 34 Alolan Graveler with Rock Tomb, Thunder Punch, Smackdown, and Rock Blast. And holding the hard stone. And lastly, we have Buttons, our starter, the level 35 Decidueye with Raised Leaf, Spirit Shackle, Pluck, and Tackle, now holding the Decidium Z. That's our team. Who's the fastest? Oracorio actually the fastest? Let's see here. 81. Look how slow my team is. 81, 31, 31, 61, 33. That's actually kind of wild. Alolan Pokemon are so slow. Oh! Well, that's a good way to start. Now, as you know, we've already caught one shiny in this series. Uh, we've already caught one shiny in this series, and part of that is because we don't use repels unless it gets super annoying. Like, if we can't escape for some reason... Okay. Also, they're level 34. I'm level 34. This might wind up... Nope, you're not getting me. Water. Yes, give him fresh water. Don't die, my guy. Oh, thank you. Delicious. The, water's flow the water flows in... What? The water flowed into every cell in my body. Thank you, I've been revived. I was so thirsty I couldn't walk. Duffle? Where did you come from? Oh, it's my Stuffle! I see you got worried because I didn't come back, so you came here to look for me. This little one must have followed you when you opened the door. Wait, that Stuffle was the one at the, uh... He was out at the, whatchamacallit? Yeah, at the motel. Alright, so when we come out of here, we're gonna have to stop at the motel. Also, if we can't escape from all of these things, we can't put up a repel because they're all higher level. Well, this is gonna... We just kind of have to hope that Frisco can escape. Okay. Thought. Thought. I'm do- oh wait, what's the point in dodging those if you can run into Pokemon elsewhere? Crocorock! Where's his sunglasses? You know, I've always thought that Crocorock without sunglasses looked so weird. I've always thought that. Because I'm so used to anime Crocorock. Alright, I don't remember the way to go. Also, how awesome would a shiny Crocorock be? Or a shiny, what's the other thing we ran into? A Lowland Dugtrio. 
Would I use a shiny Alolan Dug Trio over my Graveler? Maybe. Or get this thing off my tail. I don't know how big this area is. If it winds up being too big, I'm gonna wind up doing this later. Like, pretty much, if I can go down from here... You know what? Uh... Okay, I can't go down. That's good. That's good, at least. I can't go down here. Alright, one of these has to be... No, never mind. If we wind up finding a shiny, it's gonna be extremely high. So, you know... It just takes... It's gonna take some patience, okay? Set the video to two times speed if you need to. Set the video to two times speed. Okay... You know, I was literally thinking that I should run on these rocks because I wouldn't be able to encounter Pokemon. Well, turns out that was wrong. That was incorrect. So I'm thinking after we finish this, we need to grab Sharpedo and continue backtracking. Wait, what is this? Wait a minute. Did I know this was here? Is this what I think it is? Find out in just a second. That's what I thought. Is this what I think it is? Psychium Z. That was not what I thought it was. So, wait. This is episode what? Episode... 43. We got Psyche. Um, the. Oh, Psyche. Psyche. Um. Don't auto correct me, computer. I know what I'm typing. Why is the Psyche MZ just like randomly here? Well, there you go. Now you know where the Psyche MZ is. I don't know if we'll ever get to use the Psyche MZ because Oracorio doesn't learn Psychic like that. Maybe it does, but I know it learns Revelation Dance, uh, which is like what we're going to be using. Oh. Eh. There we go. We're going to be using Revelation Dance as our Psychic move. using revelation dances are just like that okay that's what I was thinking cool I mean I'm okay with that okay Taurus I get it you don't have to be dramatic I'm scared after this encounter, what do I do? Crocorock! Okay, I've, I've seen enough Crocorocks today. Crocodile is my favorite Gen 5 Pokemon. If that tells you how much I dislike Gen 5, Crocorock is my favorite Gen 5 Pokemon. I don't much enjoy them. I don't much enjoy Gen 5 Pokemon. I don't know why. I also guess I don't really enjoy too much Gen 6. Gen 7 is better. I'm still curious what they're going to do next. Do we go to a new, like, universe of Pokemon? Are they just going to throw away everything that we've done so far? Is Rotom still talking? Are there totem stickers that I've been missing? I don't think so. I think I've been looking. I think I've been looking for the most part. But as I've said in many videos before, I think that when you run into a wild Pokemon, you should have the ability to say, like, you should have the ability to attempt to run away beforehand. And, like, maybe some Pokemon are just passive and they don't want to kill you. 
I mean, do you ever think about that? All right, we're almost done with this area, though, which... Unless we run into something shiny. Please don't let it be a shiny dead trio. Please don't. Granted, I don't have one of those. But... Hold on. Hold on. It'll let me run. Hold it. All right. A trio, you stay under that ground. Is that it? There's no way. There gotta be one more off this way. There's gotta be. There's, there, this has to be. There's gotta be at least this one more way. One more way. Watch, shut up. Okay, thank you. Oh, I did not click that. What did it say about a breath of fresh air? Frisco breathed in a breath of fresh air. Where? Apparently it wasn't. Gosh darn. This is just back to the beginning. All right, I think we're out of here. Yeah. Get out of here. Okay, had enough. Thank you. Thank you for your contributions. I am flying out of here. Let's go over here. Whew! Deserts are always like, when can I get out of here? Deserts are never fun to go into. All right, let's heal up. Who's our lowest level? Who lead with them? I think we're gonna go meet somebody that I don't really remember because he's gen five. I, I've only played through gen five a few times, not much. Uh, we can go on, okay. That'll be fine. All right, let's head on over here, I believe. Wait, we're going back to the... We're going back to the Aether house. What's back at the Aether? Oh, Team Rocket's back at the... Team Rocket. Team Skull is here. Oh, what was her voice? I don't know. I don't know. I saw her voice is going to be different. Back so soon, hmm? I wasn't expecting you just yet. It takes these dumb grunts way too long to deal with you kids. So I guess it's my turn now. What? I told you before. Next time you get in our way, I'm not holding anything back. So that means that you're going to use your highest level Pokemon. You're going to use your Z moves that you probably have. Alright, Plumeria. Let's go. Let's go, girl. You have two Pokemon. One of them is the gold bag. Plumeria, you're not. Alright, here's the oh my gosh, you're level 37. Whoa! I can think of one solution. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Here we go! Game time! Yeah! Yeah! Huh? Alright, our Kenimon. One shot. One shot. This gold bag. One shot it. Ah. It, oh no 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 But that is why I caught this guy. This is actually exactly why I caught this guy. Look at his damage. Did eight. That did eight damage. That rock blast. Poison Fang. That's not gonna do much either. Ooh, that did more. But... Brock. Ooh, it seems that Brock has been through some Pokemon refresh. He has. Can confirm that Brock has been through his Pokemon refresh. Brock is level 35. 
It's a Lazzle. Okay, um, I'm just gonna stay in. I'm just gonna stay in. Might as well. And we're gonna go for another Rock Blast DC mode. Why does the Lazzle get Dragon Pulse? Really? Really? Is that how you feel? Is that how you feel, Salazzle? I didn't realize that was how you felt, to be honest. Why? I mean, I know that it's higher level, but... Goodness gracious! Is this is what's gonna happen. Because we're underleveled, we're just gonna get smacked up. Also has flamethrower. The Salazzle is like the greatest thing ever. Ah, duh, yes. Yeah, you don't have Pokemon Refresh. You don't have a Rotom Dex. You should get yourself a Rotom Dex. Huh, I can't even stand myself right now. I am so bad at female voices. Hold on, I got, hold on, I think I got it. Hmm, I guess you are pretty tough. Now I understand why my grunts waste so much time battling kids. But if you want us to turn, return the Pokemon, then you'll have to come to us, alone. The boss is dying to meet you. <laughs> See you at our base in Po Town. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ugh, battles you can't afford to lose aren't any fun. Are you guys okay? Oh no, you took Lily, didn't you? D Never mind, you did not take Lily. Oh, you took the young goose. My, my young goose. We can't forgive this. Darn it, those numbskulls actually did something pretty clever for once. If we want to get the Pokemon back, then Domino has to go to Po-Town, all alone, with no backup? That's what they said, but that's not fair. Team Skull has taken over Po-Town. It's basically their private playground now. Oh, I know. If you're gonna go, though, try to find this guy on Route 15 who's wearing a kimono. He might be able to help you get to Po-Town. He knows a whole lot about Pokemon that can travel across the water. Here, take this. Just, just get my youngest back from. <laughs> get my youngest back from. <laughs> See, I, I work retail right now, but I can, I can tell you for a fact that, like, the kid would be crying. The kid would be crying their face out right now. Oh, sorry. I yawn so much. I yawn so much, and it turns my eyes red. You see that? Oh my goodness! Okay, are we good? Nope. Face is still red. Can confirm, face is still- Whoa! I forgot we got smacked! Holy cow! Oh, this one. Alright, Mr. Mr. Grimsley. I just spoiled that. If you're watching this for the first time, and I just spoiled who's coming to see this, let me know in the comments below. I feel bad. I... I hope it's somebody different. I hope it's somebody different. So it's not spoilers. My goodness. I don't know why I'm so tired. It's legit breaking the fourth wall. It is honestly not even 5 o'clock. It is not even 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Not in the morning. If it was 5 o'clock in the morning, I'd understand. It's not even 5 o'clock in the afternoon. It is he. I do not have a voice for this guy. Let's see what he looks like. Let me get a voice from him. A trial goer, huh? And why would you be coming to a lonely odd place like this? I've got to get Team Skull. Uh-huh, I see you've got your reasons. Then I'll take you on. Tell me, um, Uncle Grimsley is going to flip a coin. Will it be heads or tails? I always flip tails. You can code a coin flip, but you do, can't do anything for Zygarde. I'm kidding. I'm just kidding. That was a joke. Astonishing. You just took a stab like some kind of prophet. Right now, you and your Pokemon are shining brilliantly. A loss is a loss. I'll give you Sharpedo's info for your ride page. Write it to me. Maybe you don't need to hear this from me, but I'm going to tell you anyway. 
If you press B while riding on Sharpedo there, it'll jet forward and smash through those rocks like those just there. And here's a bit more unwanted advice. Hotown lies on the other, at the other side of Route 16 there, but it's thoroughly occupied by Team Skull. You shouldn't go there unless you want trouble. That little camera angle was nutty. Okay, so... Two things I want to do, because the episode is like, we're pretty much over, almost. But, there's two things I want to do real quick. Two things I want to do real quick, while we just got our Sharpedo. Let's backtrack. Oh my gosh, this music. It even sounds like we haven't been here. Um... Yes. Oh, I want the other ride Pokemon. Yeah! Let's go, Sharpedo! Woo! Oh! Oh! I got moves! I got moves with Sharpedo! What you know about that? You didn't know anything about my Sharpedo move. Should I make that the episode title for this episode or next episode? I guess that I guess you'll know. If this episode is not titled something to do with Sharpedo, next one. All right, hold on. Check, check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Woo! You didn't even know you could do that. You didn't even know you could do that. Look at that! Pretty sure it's just a TM in here. Look at me and my Pokemon Encyclopedia. That's right. Explosion! Ooh! That was the Pokemon Cypher that just went through my head. Alright, let's fly. Let's go now to... Sandy Cave. Oh, it's... it's not called Sandy Cave. It's called Seaward Cave. I really do not remember it ever being called Seaward Cave. Or, say, I do not remember it being called Sandy Cave. Alright. Wrong side. Wrong side. I need to be on the other side. Also, in here, you can find Seal. I caught Seal and Dugong. Well, I caught, I didn't catch Dugong, but obviously you can evolve to Dugong. But catch a Seal in here. Pretty interesting. I think if we do a Wonder Lock for this game, which we might. We might. Now, would that be copying other people? I don't know. A Wonder Lock just sounds super fun. But gosh darn it, I might do it. Right? Because if I think it's fun, just because someone else has done it, etc, etc. Well, today's episode was just all kinds of... I could have sworn that the, the desert was one of those, like... Enter this area, exit this area. I did all this for a light clay. I did that for a light clay. I did that for a light clay. Don't do that. Just because you have Sharpedo does not mean you need to go back anywhere. Explosion and light clay. That's all. That's all that you need. That's all that you can get with Sharpedo. That's wild. That's wild. But after you get Machamp Shove. Alright, let's check. So over here on Akala. I mean, you can smash some rocks there, but there's no need to do it. So then let's go ahead and fly back here. And I guess we'll go ahead and wrap up today's episode. So today's episode, we went through the... Is it called Haina Desert? Wait a second. Wait a second. I'm forgetting something. Hold the phone. Every time I go that way, Tauros runs into that. Hold on. Wait. I don't remember you being here. Behind the desert is like nature's own maze, but they say you can find your way through if you keep a close eye on the stone stacks. Someone once said that the answer is 2143, but what's that supposed to mean? 
Is there a different way to go than the way I went? Oh, you're the one who gave me a fresh water. You're my savior. You really saved me there. This time I've got plenty of fresh water. I bought a lot, so I'll give you some. Okay. So that small mission was to get 10 fresh waters. Okie dokie. Sure. So this guy said something about 2143. All right, here's what we're going to do. In the next episode, we are going to make our way towards Poe Town. I'm going to do this in between episodes, and if anything is different than what we've already done, that's where we'll start the next episode at. If you wound up enjoying today's episode, make sure to hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new, because both of those things help us in becoming the next big thing. We'll see you in the next episode of Pokemon Ultra Moon, the expanded Let's Play. Until then, have a blessed day.